Oh, have you ever fancied a little trip to London? Let's just delve into why you might want to reconsider that profoundly enlightening idea. First up, the British weather. It's a common assumption that London is a city of constant rain and overcast skies. And it's true, it rains, usually a constant drizzle that will make you go mad. With average temperatures between 4 degrees C to 9 degrees C in the coldest months and 15 degrees C to 23 degrees C in the hottest months, get ready to freeze and get soaked all year round. The unpredictable weather is part of the London experience, whether you like it or not, it should. Now that we've weathered the storm, let's move on to our second point. London, proudly hailed as the world's inaugural national park city, may not exactly be a haven for nature enthusiasts seeking serene relaxation. With just around 300 green spaces peppering its landscape and a mere 49.5% of its territory boasting verdant hues or serene blues, the city's natural embrace seems rather limited. The thought of less than half the city enveloped in nature might prove unsettling. Amidst navigating London's urban hustle, encounters with deer, llamas, squirrels, parakeets, and swans are not uncommon. So exercise caution and ensure your safety as you traverse its vibrant streets. On to our point three. London stands tall as Europe's tourism hub, drawing a staggering 20 million visitors annually. Attempt a journey during rush hour on the Central Line or navigate the bustling thoroughfares of Oxford Street or Camden Market on a Saturday afternoon, especially before the festive season, and you'll grasp the essence of what I mean. So resist the urge to follow the masses and delve into the authentic heart of London. Prepare to be enchanted by vibrant local communities and hidden gems awaiting your discovery. From the tranquil charms of Little Venice to the urban allure of the Isle of Dogs, the historic intrigue of the Knights Templars to the cultural vibrancy of Brixton, each corner reveals a unique facet of London's essence. Embark on a journey beyond the beaten path to uncover the true essence of this iconic metropolis. Point four brings us to London's reputation as overly modern and gentrified might lead one to overlook its rich historical tapestry. While the city's official age stands at a relatively youthful 1,976 years, its origins trace back to the Romans, who established Londinium in what is now the City of London, near Bank. From these modest beginnings, London gradually expanded into the sprawling metropolis it is today. Granted, remnants of its ancient past are scattered throughout the urban landscape. Roman ruins, temples, amphitheaters, Templar sites, crypts, churches, and imposing historic monuments stand as testament to its storied history. Yet, beyond these tangible relics, one might perceive a dearth of historical depth in London. Moving on, let's take a look at our fifth point. And finally, with a mere 40,000 restaurants to its name, London's culinary landscape may appear surprisingly limited. However, heed this advice. Disregard TripAdvisor reviews and eschew the temptation of indulging in a delightful Sunday roast at a quaint British pub. Resist the allure of sampling some of the city's finest ramen or exploring top-rated Chinese, Italian, French, Afro-Caribbean, Lebanese, or vegan eateries scattered throughout town. Even renowned street food markets such as those in Brixton, Borough Market, Spitalfields, and Tooting are dismissed as unworthy pursuits. And whatever you do, steer clear of afternoon teas. The prospect of lingering in a cozy tea room, savoring fragrant Earl Grey accompanied by delectable nibbles or cream tea, should hold no appeal whatsoever. I trust this video has provided ample reasons to dissuade you from considering a visit to London. However, if you remain undeterred and wish to see for yourself, explore some of the city's most authentic off-the-beaten-path experiences in this video.